Hi everyone, it's Soul Guidance Monday. It is July 21st and I wasn't going to do this video today because I'm a little upset. My uh, stepdad is dying of pancreatic cancer and um, it just doesn't look good and it just is amazing. Just a, uh, In May I was camping with all of them and my gosh he had so much energy and he was doing far more than any of us and um, it's just amazing how fast this happened and how he started having pains like four weeks later and next thing you know he's in the hospital. So it's just really strange but I did a lot of research yesterday and I I am a vegan and I've started doing this since April and I, I'm so grateful I have. I started in April and then in May I watched a movie called Forks Over Knives and if you haven't seen it please watch it. It talks about the dairy and meats industries and how they actually took over and um, <laughs> and uh, they um, I'm, I apologize there is a cat trying to look over the camera <laughs> it's kind of funny um, of course you didn't see him do that but uh, he's being kind of goofy anyhow the dairy industry um, when dairy and meat products were introduced into the diets of the United States is when pancreatic kind of, uh, uh, any kind of cancer, diabetes, heart disease started really uh, increasing in our country and it continues to increase and I would suggest anyone look at the research, watch the movie Forks Over Knives. There's two gentlemen that were born on a dairy farm and they're now in their 70s but they both uh, came to the same conclusion around the same time in their career of their life and did this movie together and it's fascinating to watch how their studies came up with this and saying how Asian cultures eat a lot of high carbohydrates low fat and how uh, they don't have the same disease as we do and they're very healthy and they live long lives so um, I think it's really important to take a look at that look at everything you put in your mouth I, I don't know how we as Americans don't figure this out I went on a drive and on Saturday and noticed that all the allegiance or all of these um, hospitals are so nice and manicured and and just they look like they have so much money and then all around them are the Popeyes and Sonics and Kentucky Fried Chicken no one is putting together the two and two together that it's the food you're eating that is making you sick so if you really recognize if man made it don't eat it okay and then when it comes to meat and dairy they inject antibiotics hormones all of that stuff into all of that and we digest that and that is our body takes everything to fight that off and the same with alcohols they're very toxic some poisons cigarettes we've known that has been poison for the longest time and yet people still do it so please look at your health if you're looking to raise your vibration have a better life eat better treat yourself better physically and you'll find that your your mood stabilize pretty well if you do that. Uh, today's card is make necessary sacrifices. That's funny. I, I didn't even know the card but as I think that's poetic for what we're talking about today because sometimes you know our mind gets very addicted. Our, our, our brain gets very addicted to some of the foods that we eat. They purposely put things in our food so we are wanting and craving them and <clears throat> you know people watch me eat salad without any dressing because the oils um, are so high in fat so I don't eat that either and what's interesting is all of that is is covering up the real taste and flavor I haven't had any oils or anything like that so all of the the awesome flavors of a carrot and a pepper and lettuce I can taste and my smell, my sense of smell is just incredible. But here's the card for today, make necessary sacrifices. Is your heart set on a particular goal or desire, yet you hesitate to commit for fear of what's required for success? Are you wishing for more in some part of your life, yet you're unwilling to change anything to make room for something new? Are you seeking the prospect of a greater interest in and involvement with others, yet resist upsetting your comfortable routines? If so, take notice that you're standing 
at an important junction in your life, one where your spiritual adolescent faces your spiritual adult. Your soul's purpose right now is to sacrifice short-term conveniences for long-term gains. For every step you take towards your heart desires, you must step away from the comfortable routine of the moment. Your soul's lesson, be willing to make the fleeting sacrifices necessary to achieve your goals and accept the temporary inconveniences and demands that come with commitment. It may seem that what you must give up in order to attain your goals is too great to risk. But rest assured that in the end, your sacrifices will be rewarded many times over. I have to agree with that. What a great card for today. Hope you have a great week. I don't know if I'll get to another video this week, but I have a couple of my brother-in-law's videos that I'm going to be posting. So have a great week. If I don't see you tomorrow, I'll see you next week. Thanks.